Who's gonna use it? Not it. <laughs> I can see those flabby arms getting tone already. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so as you've probably guessed, we're gonna cut open a shake weight. You just shake it back and forth. So we're gonna cut one open and see uh, what makes the shake weight shake. <laughs> Inside the shake weight are dual moving weights called dynamic inertia. Okay, it's mounted. That's about my max. Oh, you just ruined it. <laughs> I'm it. We hit something hard. That one was a little messier than normal. <laughs> and there's that shaft in the middle. It looks like right there we barely hit it and kind of trimmed off the sliver. So it struggled through the bottom half that way. Time spent per inch of material, I think this took longer than the gun did. <laughs> I think the that spring stop pushes it back and forth. Yeah, I think the spring was between this stop and the, the housing right there. And so it would push this stop, which would then push the entire handle over. So there it is. Water jet can cut a shake weight, but just barely. The shake weight actually almost defeated the water jet. Mitchell's just speechless. Uh -huh, I'm gonna get my work out of it. <laughs> Mitchell's really upset. He thought he was going to get two, two and a half pound shake weights out of this. <laughs> Five pounds was a little much for me, but I was hoping for one in each hand. Okay, so leave a comment what you thought in this video. You can also suggest other things that you want us to cut open. What else? If you got any good recipes, let us know in the comments. <laughs> any jokes? <laughs> Just, uh, yeah. Give us some ideas. <laughs>